welcome to data pandit today we are going to solve one more kind of scenario based question so these kind of questions being asked in initial interview question interview process right so uh, the scenario is like we have an data file which you know these are the this is this part is input this left part and the expected output is like this so we have a field 1 and field 2 and the expected output is like you know field 1 and field 2 as well okay f let's say i label it as an f1 and f2 okay so the question is like uh, we have some same number of records in the output also and uh, but we want to reverse the second field right so so first we will talk about why these kind of scenario is getting asked you know in interview questions the motto of these questions is like they want to test our uh, ab initio knowledge i mean how best you can utilize your ab initio knowledge to solve a kind of you know problem uh, you know data problem and how uh, Le how many you know uh, steps you are going to take actually how less you know or how best uh, in optimal way you can uh, create a component uh, create a graph so that it can be quickly solved actually you know what what is your thinking process to to uh, you know divide the problem and then you know assemble the problem as a solution right so the question is a uh, question to, to answer is a kind of steps of process right you split, split the process you break down the problem and then you try to assemble as a solution right so in uh, while looking at the data the input data and the output expect, expectation is like uh, we have a uh, two fields first field, so some kind of different processing we, we need to have for field one and field two. So we need to split the field one and field two first and then apply the different process on field one and field two and then try to again back merge into you know one 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 output data set basically probably the join and maybe the fuse right. So these uh, so if you need first of all you need to know I mean how how many utilities we have in ab initio and then your uh, thinking will be applied right if you might have solved this own question earlier or probably you know you can uh, then and there you can think of these kind of questions and then try to solve it right and there could be multiple ways of solving it but let's see i mean how best we can so we, what we we can do we need to split the process and we then we will try to solve it right so let me see i mean how best what we can do is get the in, take the input and then in the reformat or uh, maybe in the filter by expression also right don't use the reformat filter by expression sorry in the reformat itself we cannot do in filter by expression because i want to split the uh, split the first field and second field so what we can do is we can take the count of two in reformat and then in transform one we can map the uh, only the output first output might be with the field field one and second output would be the field two right and then what we can do is in between we need to do some process right so let me do what we can do right uh, let me put up another process over here so i think in between right i need to have this process from the reformat uh, my this component should come over here right, uh, let me check I think this is not working so the thing is like we need to uh, sort it there sort the data okay first right sort the data and and sort the data and then try to fuse it right maybe we can create one more field basically here itself we can create one more field 
right in the uh, transform second transform we can create one more field called uh, you know next in sequence okay so that will assign the you know num uh, next in sequence and then the that uh, data could be passed into the uh, into the sort right and then uh, uh, sort basically on the newer created field right so that it will be reversing the order of the uh, placement of the data right so if you look at the cv uh, abc would be you know converted into the cva because abc so we will have a next in sequence sort and c sort will be on the newly created field right next in sequence will be assigned within the reformat over here in the second uh, transform and then what we can do is uh, like after sorting we can fuse the data right so let me if i could take this one so i can fill up with some other color let's say okay Maybe this one and then right from output of this sort will go into the second uh, uh, input port of fuse and this this can be fused and then the output will be created so these kind of thinking you can do i mean you can design this graph right uh, okay and uh, yeah i mean uh, we can solve these kind of questions right thank you so much please subscribe my channel and we will solve these kind of you know new questions as well thanks